Good afternoon. Welcome to my video. Can of butter infused Garibaldi double chocolate brownies. Delicious is all I can say. Of course, comes out of my kitchen here in Aloha. Just enjoying life and enjoying some brownies here for us. Really simple ingredients. The important part, of course, is the cannabis butter. Otherwise, you'd just be making regular brownies. And the cannabis butter is right there in the middle center. It's kind of like the darkish uh, pea colored green here for us. Just going to pretty much pour, pour, pour it all into a large bowl. Add the water, vanilla, brownie mix. Uh, add in the walnuts. Once again, this is really a pretty straightforward recipe as far as that goes. Uh, as you can see here, I'm just going to be adding the vanilla with the egg. Kind of like beat them all together here for us. Gonna pull the brownie mixture out. Boom. I usually buy it in a larger container. I get it from like Costco. You get like, I think, six or eight of them at a time. Just more uh, cheaper to buy it that way. Buy it in, in, in bulk. It doesn't go bad anyway, so you might as well just enjoy it. So it's pretty straightforward here. Just the brownie mix. Typical stuff. You can buy at your local grocery store. Nothing in Nothing super important or anything like that here for us. Just going to toss that in here for us for a couple of minutes. And I'm going to turn around and toss in the can of butter. And, of course, you can see it's at room temperature. Look how soft it is at that point. Um, you're going to be beating it, so you might as well get it, you know, don't melt it in the microwave. You'll ruin it. You might as well just hit it and you just have butter then. But, um, yeah, you definitely want at this point just mix it a little bit together. This is the egg and the vanilla mixed together. Makes a smoother uh, recipe. Needs a little bit of water, so I just rinse the bowl out with it also. Like I said, this is pretty straightforward. Nothing um, terribly difficult or anything like that. Um, a mixture with a hand dill, a hand blender, a spatula, whatever you prefer here. You can see it's not an awful, awful lot of, of hard work here to do to get it mixed. Got the nuts involved here for us. Coming up, these are just walnuts. What I did is I just uh, break them up a little bit in the bag there with a heavy hammer, just uh, so that they're not just huge uh, holes. Once again, I get this stuff like from Costco. It's 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 if you're gonna bake, you might as well you know get the right stuff here for us. The uh, muffin pans are actually the cupcake liners are actually uh, silicone. I found those on Amazon, of course. And so it just makes it a little bit easier just to shove it in there. They don't stick. That way I'm not spraying it or, or anything like that. Um, this is a two tablespoon um, ice cream uh, scoop. So uh, I use the same thing for making cookies here for us. It doesn't look like an awful lot, but there is actually an awful lot that goes into these things for us. And of course, like I said, these are just, these are Teflon or silicone. Uh, cup liners. So uh, once you get done with them, just rinse them off, wash them good, and soap and water, and away we go here for us. So you can see we made uh, approximately two dozen of them here for us. I'm just trying to make sure everything's kind of a little bit leveled out here for us. Once again, this is really, really, really a simple recipe. Um, the can of butter, obviously, is, is the uh, clue to this whole thing here for us. Uh, otherwise, it'd be just regular brownies. Can of butter I make, oh, on occasions, it's really super easy to make. Um, just a little cannabis and some butter, really. And that's about the whole trick of just kind of like wait it out here for us. So once again, let's look at the kind of pans I have here for us. These things here are silicone pans with silicone um, containers in them. I like to kind of like shake it down, try to get some of the air bubbles out of them. Uh, it gives me kind of an idea of how they bake a little bit better and stuff like that. But once again, it's like uh, they're really easy. Um, nothing terribly difficult. I mean, this is this is the kind of stuff you can learn to, to, to cook on the first, you know, if you take uh, Cooking 101, this is definitely it. After they uh, get ready to be baked, just a better, clearer picture how full they are. Not really that full. Just going to bake them um, uh, 30 minutes. 33 minutes. Got to make sure you don't overcook them because then they're just like little rocky things that they bounce off the floor for it. But um, that's good. Okay. You can check them. Toothpick does a trick for them. And you can see they came out. And just a real quick deal of why we're doing this. Uh, this is I live in Oregon. And um, 2014, they uh, 
legalize recreational marijuana and so basically we came up with a channel here and my assistants here that helped me in the kitchen today really love them and they're really a lot of fun here to deal with and of course we filmed it on the left coast of the united states of america oregon thank you very much for your time today you have a nice day